Coach, uh, certainly a very exciting effort at the end of the game uh, by the running Bulldogs. By our count, uh, at one point it was a 19-2 run that you guys made uh, after being down by 19. Uh, just talk a little bit about that effort to come back. Well, you know, I told you the pregame. You know, I'm really proud of this basketball team. They're picked to win the Southern Conference. They're a very good basketball team. In uh, 21, again, I'm not going to even try to pronounce her name, but uh, she's as good as any player that's ever been in this gym since I've been here. Now, I don't want, you know who's been in here before me. Great player. I thought our players played with a lot of heart. I was very proud of them. We, did, we kept fighting back. And even when we got down, we just wasn't making shots. You know, we just wasn't making shots. And uh, so, again, I'm very, very proud of this basketball team. Coach, what are, what are some of the other uh, specific things that you see? Uh, obviously, we had some, some really good efforts. Uh, one of them by a freshman, Lana Doran, had 14 points, had some big shots down the stretch. Uh, but really, just the, the, the will to come back when you're down 19 with eight to go. Well, uh, you're absolutely right, Jared. You know, we never quit. You know, we talked about uh, giving great effort, and I, and I thought we did. Did we make some mistakes? Yeah, but, you know, we're, getting, we're so much better than we were against Longwood right yeah. now. So I, I'm really pleased. Coach, uh, you got a little bit of a break before you got to head out on the road again here to Wofford in a few days, but certainly uh, some good things to build on tonight against Davidson. We oh, yeah, it. yeah. You know, wonderful young ladies. We've really done it well in the classroom. Uh, we appreciate our fans came out. We had a function on campus, and uh, which you know sometimes that just happens. You were scheduling everything, and uh, but still we had a lot of fans get get, uh, get out tonight and support us. And again, I'm just feel very fortunate to be the coach here at Gardner Webb, and I love this place. And I wish all of our fans a very blessed Christmas. Now I'm gonna turn it over to somebody a lot better looking me. Than, okay. <laughs> Doreen, good to have you on the post-game report. Uh, tell us a little bit about that comeback uh, at the end of the game. Um, the comeback was really good. I'm really, like, ecstatic with my team because all weekend long, like all week long, we always coach about heart, never to give up. And I'm just proud that we didn't give up and we actually fought back. And next time we play the team, I'm pretty sure we got the win. <laughs> you guys are on a big run at the end of the game. What what kind of things do you do you do in practice that you talk about, like you said, uh, to get yourself prepared for any kind of circumstances that you face in the game? And, you know, 19 points down with eight minutes to go. A lot of teams go down and, you know, put, hang their heads down a little bit. That didn't happen tonight. Um, well, we had a conversation about heart. It's always about heart. Like, you just never give up. Um, we always practice game situations as well. But then Parker when it comes down to it, it's just about heart and effort. Like, you don't want to show people that you're a quitter. You show people that you're a winner, whether you lose or not. Doreen, you guys played one of the, uh, or the team that's picked to beat uh, everybody else in the Southern Conference this year. Took them the distance. Uh, so, you know, obviously you're never happy with a loss, but certainly got to be proud of the effort. And you guys uh, got a bright future ahead of you. Of course. And I'm looking forward to taking the team all the way to the championship. That's what it takes. All right. Doreen, thanks so much for your time. Appreciate it. Thank you.